We were talking about our favorite game consoles and the battery ran out. So we will edit this in. You had mentioned that PS1 is yes. your favorite because of RPGs. Yes, because the RPGs have a soft spot for me. It's just what got me into basically gaming as a whole. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then I had said I have never really pay, played an RPG, especially one of those older ones. And if you had to pick one RPG for me to play to get me hooked on that genre, what would you say? It's going to have to be a Final Both Fantasy. Both of you guys are RPG guys. It, it's going to have to be a Final Fantasy. It'll have to be a Final Fantasy game. Which you one? cannot go wrong. Which one? There's like... Now, see, that's where it comes down to... be, what, to... 17 of them now, or...? <laughs> I can't speak for all of them. Uh, seriously, how many? Is I, it? I, I I lost 16, track. I think, there is, there is I think a lot. sixteen oh, is the newest far one. Off, then. Yeah, I think yeah. sixteen is the newest one. Yeah. Um, for me, seven, eight, nine, and ten were my favorites. I played like two. <clears> and which three. one? What pick one? Which if you're one? to start the very first one, first RPG. I would probably play Final Fantasy two on the Super Nintendo. Really? Yes. The story is awesome. The characters are awesome, and it. Anybody can play it. You don't have to be like, oh, I, you know, an R RPG savant to, to figure out what you need okay. to do. Okay. You just follow, okay, you need to go here, you need to do that. Yeah. It, Could I play it? Yes. <gasps> oh, absolutely. Well, yeah, it's Super Nintendo game, right? Because it's very like, almost like playing Zelda with how you move your characters. All right, my other Ooh, question yes. for you for that game would be how many hours does it take to get through it? So I'm, a, I'm an adult now. Okay. I don't have that if, much time. If you want to get the secrets, which Final Fantasy games are I just want to get through the story most of the time because I don't have that time to commit there. I'm a busy I boy. I can't remember how long. It would have been game. a couple dozen hours, maybe. But I don't remember how long they were we either. 20, I'd say. What are you talking about? 20, yeah, 20 hours, 30 hours. 20 hours? Yeah. 20 hours? I think yeah, something like that. Yeah, that sounds that's, awesome. that's doable. When people look at me there, I have a buddy Phil that plays a lot of RPGs, and he's like, oh, it's a 60-hour oh, we'll game, Phil, uh, that's a 100 hour. I'm like, oh, I don't have that yeah, kind of time. Yeah, 60 yeah. hours is a lot. Yeah. 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 For, no, I, 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 I can't see that Final Fantasy is more than 20. The earlier ones. You will know in the comments. Trust me, they will correct you. Uh, sorry. Yes, I, I actually would really encourage that <laughs> because I kind of want to know. I'm rusty. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm not All sure. Right. All right, what would you say? You agree with him? Or? No, I'm going to have to disagree. I like where he's coming from with yeah. being simple, but yeah. I have to say Final Fantasy VII. And there's always a big argument between I've, 7 and 8. I've I've wanted to try that. Mm -hmm. I wanted to, especially where they make a remake. Coveted. Now, would you tell me to go back and play the original yes, first? Yes, absolutely. Because I went back and played the original uh, Resident Evil 2 just recently before they put the remake out and loved it. Mm -hmm. So Love Final it. Fantasy VII is a longer game, but the reason I recommend it, its graphics didn't age well. It didn't. It, it was okay. where we were transitioning from the block animation to like a more like humanoid outline. Yeah. Like it was a big change, and you can see it because Final Fantasy VII and VIII, there's only a year gap, <clears> and the <throat> graphics change is monumental. Yeah. But uh, with Seven, you it really draws you into the characters. You're playing a genuine story with a lot of depth. Yeah. And there's a lot of however you want to play it, you can. Like, if you want to get all the secrets and unlock all the hidden characters, you can. If you want to smash the game, you can. Like, there's a lot of opportunity for that. And for me, I just, I loved everything about it. And I, I love the system. I love the combat, the characters. Uh, I, I just, I love seven it. Is, is really fun. It's right? probably my it all, one, second fun. place, I'd say. I'm going to ask everybody out there in the comments, what is my first RPG? Tell me. I'm going to put a yeah, vote out there. What should I do? Idea. I, I, Final Fantasy 2. Do, do, do you guys seven. know Fear Effect? PlayStation no. 1. Our, my buddy Phil, or your buddy, or our buddy, yeah. Yeah. Phil, Phil had recommended that to me. And I did find a copy. At, it's at an RPG? Parlor. I think Fear so. Effect? Fear Effect, I think. I could be wrong. Let yeah. us know. He told me how awesome it was there, so I did find a copy pretty cheap, and I'm like, Phil oh, would know. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. I could be wrong. Maybe it's in the wrong genre there, but... But yeah, he said I had to come in. I feel like we have to pop hours. Phil's head up, like, yeah. right here. <laughs> There's Phil. This is Phil. Yep. <laughs> Hi, Phil. All right, um, okay. Miss, did you finish your little? Yeah, PS1? I did. Yeah, the PS One for the RPGs. All right. Okay. Shoot, shoot quick. What is the longest amount of time you have sat and played a game nonstop? Twenty hours. <gasps> oh man, that's commitment. Oh. Yeah. Easy, like we're talking. Off of school, uh, start playing right, 
right after school, get myself situated. Yeah. Uh, and this is, I'm pretty sure this might have been a co-op game. Uh, eat supper. So, you, you know, in the amount of time it takes a teenager that wants to really play a game. So, like, seven minutes, probably. So, no stopping for, like, Degrassi or anything? like. Oh, man. <laughs> man. I think you might be a little young for that one. Okay. Uh, so, we would play from, like, after supper. We would go until, like, the next afternoon. Like, oh, no no God. stop. No, like, no sleep, no nothing. No, we no, would no, I have I have pulled a few all-nighters. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, my buddy Pat, we, we played... The Onomoshis. Um, yeah. There's a few other ones. I love those games. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I actually still have my save file on my card there, and I was like, ooh, I gotta get a copy of that. See. Katana's fuck up the undead. I think the morning star might need to take a step back. I can understand you. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely did it. <laughs> All right. Do, do I want to decode that or? A katana is devastating to the undead. Even yeah. more so than a morning star, which needs to take a step back. What's nice? Morning star morning. is essentially a mace, but in the Hawk end, it has man from the oh. comic books. It okay. has little mace. In thing. my mind, a morning star is the ultimate zombie killing weapon because it's blunt, but it has enough puncture wounds to get to the brain, so it doesn't get stuck. Yeah, and it's heavy ended. It's like yeah. swinging a hammer. So I, I think well, I've played some. I've pulled some all nighters. Hell, we've played some all-nighters here. Mm -hmm. And we have gotten, gotten significantly <laughs> impaired by the end of these all <laughs> We do not uh, get better as the night goes on. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and they need a I know supervision. I've played eight hours straight multiple times. I may have hit 10 or 12, but at that time, at that point, it gets pretty foggy. <laughs> yeah. Um... I don't know. I, it was probably a Donkey Kong. I would sit in my... Two hours, two and a half hours. No. I crushed it. Those no. are rookie numbers. You gotta pull those numbers no. out. Yeah, pull them up. I would get home from work at like 5.30 and play till like... 8 o'clock. It was no. just devastating. Wait <laughs> till bedtime. <laughs> Until like 2 or 3 in the morning, I had to go to work for 8 the next day. And I'm like, it's fine. Just a half an hour more. Just 15 more minutes. Just till the end of this level. Yeah. And just keep playing and playing and playing yeah. and playing. And you're like, it's 3 o'clock. I might as well continue to play. Like, it doesn't matter. Fun fact for playing games all night before you go to work. It doesn't burn that much energy to game. <laughs> so really, like, you're almost at rest. Almost. <laughs> almost. True. True. And now you know. That's why I pulled the 20 hours. <laughs> so I've never played for 20 hours. I don't know how long I would have played, but back in the day, we used, it was a computer game. A computer oh. game? Computer back in the game. day. The day. Back in they the day. Have, hey, they still have computers they in the now have, of the days. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, we used to play a game called Genghis Khan. And it, <laughs> we used to start, I mean, we used to play we for weekends. Door weekends and barely get any sleep and it was hey. lots of fun You're in a it was different video. though but it was <laughs> what's up little boy when we have to go to bed you look tired now go to bed now go to bed now you have to go and tell Santa that okay tell her to go to sleep in the spare room brush, but brush you're your interrupting the video I think Santa knows you're still up yeah brush he your teeth he knows when you're sleeping and he knows when you're awake okay you need to get a hair tie and a real job I had a real job. <laughs> get a drink, I Tell get her a I said it's time to go to bed or yeah. she doesn't sleep over in November. <gasps> you, she knows. When we go She'll on. know. Yeah, we're going yeah. on a trip, remember? Mm -hmm. Knowing is half the battle. Night, Alex. <laughs> All right. I'm going to sleep, bud. You got interrupted there. Do you uh, keep going? Or no, that's no, fine. Yeah, all right. Mm -hmm. okay. Shoot quick. Shoot quick. <clears throat> Have you ever had a crush on a video game character? Absolutely. Uh, Actually, I'm going first. Yeah, I know. Sorry. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, this is in a shout out to my fiance Kate. I like thick women with two C's. So it's gonna be May from Overwatch. And anybody who knows Overwatch is gonna know exactly why I like May the best. I don't know. I don't know. Right. I never played because Overwatch. ba boom. Because she's busty. Busty. Thick. <laughs> <laughs> Mine has to be from Borderlands. Uh, you played Mad Moxie. Moxie. Oh, wow. She's a second. <laughs> She's second place for me. Oh, yeah. I'd go to the bar just to see her. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's Princess Peach. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, that was actually the first one. I know, right? <laughs> She's classy. Oh. She's a princess. She's definitely a whore. <laughs> De oh. Definitely a whore. Oh. Wow. 
She I, likes plumbers. No, she likes. <laughs> she like she, she clearly <laughs> likes Bowser. She wouldn't be a kidnap. So she has a kingdom for fuck's sake. She has an army. What the fuck? Every time. Why does a plumber have to save her ass? Where are her troops? All right, I'm gonna stick with that pick then. I don't have one. You got one. I don't have one. You like you like Donkey Kong because it's thick. Because it's thick. Thick. When he pounds on his chest like a man. (laughs) Pounds on it like what? (laughs) (laughs) All right, next question. Yeah, you like the pounding, all right. (laughs) (laughs) Cut off again there. So we got one last question. Get through this thing. Okay. Do it. What is the worst game you have ever played? <laughs> I know a lot of games that I hate. There's too many. I hate. <laughs> I have a lot of hate. That's a that's a terrible I'm question. Looking at my, I'm people. looking at my stack over there and trying to figure out which one I hate the most. <laughs> oh no, poor game stack. Unfortunately, I'm I'm gonna take point on this. Give it. I actually hate Super Smash Bros. for the 64 because my buddy Steve beat me so bad. I rage quit and sold it from my vintage collection. My son did the same thing to me. <laughs> <laughs> is that, yes. Is that yes. the one I finally won one on? Oh and did a my. Victory lap? God, he couldn't handle the defeat. Victory it was almost the end of him. Hey, I hate that one too. It was a fluke, though. I hate it. <clears throat> it's the stupidest game. Oh. I loved it growing up, but like oh. as an adult, having adult rage and having your best friend beat you so bad when he was like, he didn't even gloat. He just went, yeah, that was all right. Yeah? Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> Try being 38 and having an 11 year old beat you, and then he get should back be to beating me. you at games though. <gasps> yeah, my sign kicks my ass. I didn't enjoy it. The but only, when only I one him. I can think of that I just I look at my stack there and I'm like, that fucking game sucks. I got it in that. Do you remember what it was called? Game treasure chest, whatever it was. Oh, yeah. I subscribed to this thing for a month and then I got a I don't know three or four games out of there, and I got for the, for the NES Russian attack, and it's one of those games where you get hit once you did, and I'm like, oh. oh, oh. <laughs> Russians are strong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't fuck with Russians. Don't fuck with Russians. It's true. All right, well, that's the only one I can think of. But right off the... I'm sure there's more. I'm sure there's more, but that's the one I just... I'm looking over there, and I'm like, I fucking hate you. Fucking <laughs> 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 Russians. There's a bunch of crappy games on the Atari. And the Atari. one that comes like, to my mind... The Wii is a bunch of crappy games. Well, wow. yes, I know, but... One of the worst ones that I, I can't even figure out why was E.T. <laughs> on the Atari. That's legendary, that one there. It's legend. Well, it is they legendarily bad. retarded. They did, a, just, they did a documentary on it. You just there. fall down a hole and then you go <laughs> with your head <laughs> to come out. <laughs> <laughs> and then you get out of the hole. And you fall right back in the hole. And then you just fall right back in the hole. And it, <laughs> 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 it is idiotic. He doesn't even get the phone home. There, there. I was, don't know because I kept falling in the hole, and I said, "I'm done with this." There was garbage. a documentary about this because there was uh, like a legend of like um, a whole tractor trailer, or, like a trailer. What do you call them there? Come on, help me out here. I'm drinking. Semi trailer. What do you call them? the tractor trailer? It was a tractor trailer. Just, just, we're just, that's transport. What? We're what? The transformer? <laughs> Did you say the transformer? She said transport. Transformer. <laughs> Robots <laughs> in disguise. <laughs> anyway, there was one that was basically buried in a landfill. Oh yeah, and yeah, they, 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 oh, they, they yeah, found yeah. it. They tracked it down. This thing was full of <laughs> ET games mostly, <laughs> no, but, they, but they had like uh, it was full of Atari games. Yeah, it, it was garbage. couldn't sell. They couldn't sell that damn thing. It was just there was terrible. a Superman game too. On the Atari, I would I can only imagine what that looked like. <laughs> it was bad. There was no super about it. Well, I gotta, like, honorable mention most of the damn Wii games I've tried there. Holy jumpins. With that being said, House of the Dead is fantastic if you like 80s horror, because yes. that shit is cheesier than the cheesiest pasta you could possibly imagine eating, and it's so much fun. <laughs> It's I'm good. sorry. It's you good. have a Samuel L. Jackson looking motherfucker coming up. <laughs> What's up, motherfucker? I'm sorry. Like you could call me motherfucker like that all you want. Like I'm on board. <laughs> you better throw yourself at them zombies, motherfucker. All right. Did you? Did okay. You, did you actually name your game you hate? 
Yeah, it was Smash Bros. Because I'm oh, yeah, so that's right. sour about oh, it. Oh, Jesus, it's been too long. You? I said Smash Bros. too because of okay, Alex. Well, I'm guess. like, I don't even want to play this <laughs> stupid game right. anymore. It sucks. All right, well, we're done with the questions there, so we're going to go play some game now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's go time. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're excited, but this, this lovely little gem is the first game. We're going to give you some game capture, and the four of us are going to have some uh, Super Mario Bros. <gasps> chaos here. <laughs> oh. so, and uh, I'm feeling that we're going to give my wife quite the workout on uh, bleeping out the swear words. Oh, God. <laughs> so it was nice to be friends with you guys while we were all still friends. Yeah. It's almost ruined my engagement. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but I, mean, I guess I'm not engaged to you guys, so hate away. <laughs> yeah, I'll hate you. Don't worry about that. And after this one, I don't know, Dennis, you have anything to add about this gem? Uh, I, I actually have, like it. I all like I like have it. to say about that game is it's an awesome game. But me and, the, me and my kids, we used to play that, and after about 10 minutes, we would hate each other. <laughs> Think of Monopoly, but much worse, and the hate comes we, much faster. We we actually played through, I don't know, we played for about an hour or so, and we're still Well, married. there was two of us. There was two. It's because they didn't get to the hard yeah. levels. Wait till, there, just, wait till the four of us. This but is there be was special. two of us. Yeah. There was two, and there's a difference. Two is okay. Three is chaotic. Four is hateful <laughs> yeah so yeah we're gonna get some game capture this and this is gonna oh, be God. this is gonna be fun and my oh, yeah. other game for the night is uh resident evil dead aim i've actually never played resident you've evil you've never played this I one haven't. you've never played this one i never I have. you haven't played this no, one but i, I only played it enough to bit. try it out now what we're doing with this this is a light gun game but you can also control the car- It's regular Re- resident evil style game when you have control of the guy so what I'm going to do, I'm going to have both TVs going. I'm going to mm-hmm. put the splitter on it. We're going to have people over on the Lazy Boys. Somebody have the controller. Regular Resident Evil. Walking around. <laughs> searching for stuff. And when you run into some zombies, the guy over here on the old or TV. Or the girl. Or the... We wouldn't trust you with the gun, would we? <laughs> 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 okay. then, then all you have to do to take over with the gun is just pull the trigger once. And then it zooms into first person shooter. So like one it, person walks and one person shoots. Yeah. And two people bang, walk, bang, two bang, people bang, shoot. bang, bang, and it's it, it. I was just blown away with the fact that I could run both TVs at he the same was time, so the same stuff. And I'm we're gonna game capture this thing. I'm just tickled pink there. I think it's <laughs> awesome. I'll try anything <laughs> once. Famous <laughs> <laughs> last words. So after we're done, maybe we'll come back here real quick and give us our give us some final thoughts. Yeah. All Sounds right. Let's good. get playing. Game on. Yeah. Game on. Alright. Oh! Go with smoke! <laughs> Dude, totally eats shits.